Hey everybody, welcome. And today I'm going to be showing you guys a glitch known as Time Stop. Now, this setup is just... Uh, I have it as like a, a recorder, so... I'm just going to be showing you guys Time Stop. So, basically as you can tell... On the bottom screen, I'm at half a heart. Kind of difficult to do this with. So basically what I did is I exited through North Clock Town. Now I'm going to go to this Gossip Stone. And there's a glitch we're going to do called Song Storage. Now basically what that means is we're going to slash our sword. And then we're going to press the Ocarina button as we saw off the clip, so. Ah, oh, I didn't get the song story there. I need to be a little bit closer to the gossip stone. Oh my god. Oh my god, just stop doing that, please. Oh my god. Okay, so now as you can see on the bottom screen, we have the ocarina out on the bottom screen. So what we're going to do is we're going to run quickly back to the north gate over here and we're going to play the song of time and while the song of time is playing we're going to walk through the loading zone and as you can see that's going to be part of now don't touch anything while you're up here and what we're going to do next is i actually have the blast max set to i believe y so if I put the blast mask on, you're going to see I have the blast mask. But now what we're going to do is we're going to jump off this cliff here. You can do it off of any cliff. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to jump off, hit the A or hit the B button to explode ourselves in midair, and we're just going to mash the A button the second we hit or the second we explode ourselves. So here we go. And as you can see, time has officially stopped. Now there's a lot of other cool things you can do with song storage, but this is just one of them. Uh, if you're not into the bottle method of uh, like, you know, catching something in the bottle and then doing mass storage and all that stuff. That's essentially how you do it. You can do it through another glitch known as song storage, which is actually... A little bit more trickier to perform seeing as you have to find a ledge and a gossip stone to actually perform it which is nice you can just and all it yeah it, what it basically does is it prevents cutscenes so it's useful uh, it's somewhat useful uh, in, um, in skipping the cutscenes in um, in stone tower I believe there's a bunch of like cutscenes like moving platforms and stuff like that in stone tower that's all that's actually quite used time stop is quite useful for stone tower um there are other methods of doing stone tower or of doing um time stop but this one is by far the easiest one um the bottle one i really don't prefer doing because i screw up on that one a lot but yeah this one is quite easy um, you can do a bunch of things with song storage, uh, I believe. This is, this, by the way, still works in 1.1 of the game, uh, which is the version I'm on, sadly. Uh, this is a physical copy, so I can't revert back and show 1.0 glitches, because all physical copies of the game now come with the patch pre-installed, so you can't do things like bottle duping and all that stuff like that that got patched. So there's not really very many interesting glitches now in 
one, but they did not fix time stop. They did not fix either version of time stop. I know the bottle version still works where you catch something in the bottle, uh, so it's in Link's hand, and you do mass storage and all that stuff like that. So that one still works, uh, but I screw up on that one a lot, so this one's a lot easier method. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time.